For two years, the Career and Technical Education Center of Hobbs has really given hundreds of students an opportunity to get a good head start on a career after high school. Alika Medina gives us the inside look at C-Tech, a school that some say has really set the bar when it comes to career and technical education. Ever since I was little, I've liked construction and like building stuff, working with my hands. And, just, and just seeing like the, the outcome of what, what you build is just, I don't know, really good. It's not just math, science, or a simple English class. The Career and Technical Education Center of Hobbs, also known as CTEC, gives high school students an opportunity to pick one of six pathways to get a head start in an industry once they graduate high school. We've got a number of, of industries, a number of employers here that are hiring our students. They're hiring our students out of high school. So why not capitalize on that time that they're in high school and prepare them for that workforce so that our employers have an employee that's more prepared to go to work for them. CTEC offers energy, manufacturing, transportation, culinary hospitality, information technology, and construction architecture. And depending on what pathway students choose, they get dual credit certifications and a step into well-paid jobs. Elias Orozco, a student at CTEC, is graduating with his OSHA 10 certification and was gifted with a toolkit to continue with construction after he graduates. If he goes to work like for a facility in Dallas, he gives them his NCCR number and they can pull up everything that he's been certified in. Hobbs Municipal School Superintendent says it's because of partnerships within the community that they've been able to succeed as a school. It's my hope that in 10 years, CTEC looks different, that there's different programs here because we've met the needs of our employers that say, I, I don't need that many more X of what ever. Great. Then what else do we need? Because there will always be needs and we will continue to evolve to meet those needs of our community. In Hobbs, Alika Medina, KOB4.